don't want to be that person driving around with just the little area cleared out. Because they will shame you on Twitter. They State will Police. shame yes, you, will. that's right. No school in Boston today, but some people do have to head into work. Yeah, let's check in on the conditions in Boston with Tashani Whitlow in Copley Square. And Tashani, how are things looking right now? Good morning, guys. Things are starting to look like they're tapering off. But, you know, to the viewers, good morning to you as well. You woke up this morning. You looked outside your window. You realized it's snowing. You turned on the TV. We told you it was snowing. And now, what more can I say besides, hey, it's snowing. Guys, we live in New England. This is not our first bout with this. But it doesn't make dealing with the conditions any easier. This is actually probably the first time we've seen a lot of blacktop on the roads here right now on Dartmouth Street and Copley Square. We see the traffic is moving smoothly. Earlier, it was a completely different story. We were talking about snow-packed roads, which were making it extremely slippery and dangerous for drivers, including myself. I had a few, oh my God, Lord Jesus, please get me to work. Uh, safely moments uh, coming into work. I had two spin outs as well as, uh, you know, I actually got stuck in the snow myself. The sidewalks are cleared. We noticed that crews came through. We, they cleared them for pedestrians because earlier we were noticing people were opting to walk in the middle of the street uh, just because it was easier to maneuver in. The snow, it's thick, it's heavy. Actually, I'm going to walk over here and I'm going to pick it up for you. Uh, look at that. This is what we're dealing with. It's thick, it's heavy, and it is wet. So I know that for schools across the state, kids don't have school today. So make a little dough, shovel the snow. You want to check on your elderly neighbors today. This is the type of snow that they should not be shoveling if they can avoid it, especially people who may have uh, heart conditions or certain health ailments. You want to stay away from that. So kids earn some money and help out your elderly neighbors. Another thing I will definitely say is we're starting to see commuters heading into work. We're seeing buses come through. We've seen more than a dozen plows come through this area right now. They're just trying to make sure that the roads are clear, the sidewalks are clear for both pedestrians as well as commuters so everyone can get where they need to go safely. Now, if you can avoid being on the roads today, it would be best just to stay inside. I also would say keep a hat with you as well. Oh, here's a crew member right now from Boston Parks in our wreck clearing up the sidewalk. You can see it's clear. You can actually start to see that cobblestone you're starting to get that back because earlier I mean you couldn't see anything it was just snow covered so please if you can stay inside do so if you have to head out just make sure you give yourself plenty of time today is not a day that you want to rush and also remember keep a hat with you I know once the rain stops it's supposed to become about 40 degrees but then you'll have to worry about melting snow and that snow falling on your head which will create uh, some nasty conditions for now live in Copley Square in Boston to Shawnee Whitlow WBZ News